Hey everyone, this is Josh from Cousins Landscaping. I just wanted to show you a job that we just completed. This is a nice Japanese themed garden bed. As you can see, we used the, the rock, the river stone, to create this stream bed look. I'm gonna switch this camera. See, we've got the Neon Star Dianthus. I would say about 95% of these plants are Japanese variants. We've got the Goshiki Osmanthus, the Japanese Plum Yu. These are Neon Star Dianthus. Here we've got a Globe Blue Spruce. We've got a large tassel fern. Right over here we've got Siberian Iris, Caesar's brother. This is Obsession Nandina. Here we've got Helen von Stein, Helen von Stein Lamb's Ear. This is a Gold Threadleaf Cypress. Over here we've got a Japanese Dwarf Mugo Pine. And up here we've got Plum Pudding Coral Bells. Of course these are Emerald Green Arborvitaes. Over here we've got what are these? These are Golden Globe Arborvitaes. And these right here are boxwoods. This is a Japanese variant, I believe. Um, actually, this is a new gen, new gen independence boxwoods. They're very, they do very well in this area and they're resistant to boxwood blight and they stay green for most of the year instead of turning that brown hue in the winter. These are a different version of a uh, Dianthus. It's Fire Witch Dianthus. This blooms all spring and summer. And over here we've got two Hinoki cypresses. These are uh, Nana Lutea. They're dwarf versions. They're probably only going to get about four feet tall. Uh, and then we've got Coral Bells. This is champagne color. Over here that's Peach Flambe. Back there, we've got lime marmalade. Over here, we've got more plum pudding. And here, we've got a dwarf Japanese maple in the front as a showpiece. Coming over here, we've got pulmonaria raspberry splash. We've got more Japanese plum muse, but this is the golden dragon variant that gets yellow. Here, we've got cat mint. This is cat mint cat's pajamas. And then over here we've got uh, American Holly. Now this is going to fill in the area, so we wanted to fill in the area in front of it with an evergreen perennial. This is Helleborus. We did little sections of different colors. This right here is Molly's White. This right here is Anna's Red, and then we've got a pink in there as well. More Siberian Iris up there. And we've got a Stilby. Actually, this is a Siberian I Iris. The iris in the rock bed is Japanese variegated, uh, iris insata variegata. And you see we've got path lighting all throughout here as well, and we've got up lighting on the house. And here's the delivery guy. Here is Teco Block Blue 60 um, Champlain Gray. It is an onyx black border. This color goes fabulous with bluestone, as you can see up here on the porch. We've got natural stone veneer in an ashlar pattern, and we've got natural bluestone on top. You can see this is all different colored blues. Let's get this package out of the way. We've got different blue hues, and then we've got these steps that have one long piece of bluestone. This is all thermal bluestone, so it's got that rugged texture on top. That looks really nice.